Hello everyone and welcome back to ReZero. Today we're doing Frozen Bonds. This is the sequel to Memory of Snow in terms of like it being a sequel, I don't know, but, but apparently it takes place after it. Uh, you guys have helped me in the comments saying that uh, this takes place between Arc 2 and 3. And uh, yes, <laughs> I think they're, they're supposed to be one after another, apparently. I don't know. <laughs> That's that's what I read anyway, so I'm gonna I'm gonna take that into account and uh, think that this is after the one that we just saw, which was amazing. Uh, I don't have a prediction. I just want to get straight into it. So I hope you enjoy. Sit down, get some snacks, and enjoy. It is cold, by the way, today. So yeah, it is like 10 minus degrees Celsius outside. So I need I need warmth. <laughs> but I might I might be a little bit stuff stuffy and sniffly, but that's all right. We you know, we can all get past that. All right, enjoy. Oh, Welp. I haven't seen Amelia in battle much, but I didn't think she was this good. Oh, oh god. Ugh. Dude, what are you fighting? Like, abominable snowmen or something? Jesus Christ, she's trying to help you! Are you fucking kidding me, dude? Be so racist that you can't even appreciate help. Yeah, okay. What? What does that mean? We're still in the forest. Why are there so many sculptures in there? Oh my lord. Oh my lord. That's weird. The frozen bond. Oh, <laughs> a little chilling cold open here, quite literally. Well, these are not horrible to her. They look comfy, comf comfy. Well, at least he cares a little bit, I guess. You have some decency for human life, it seems, even though you may not think she is. Ah, oh, yes, I see now why Emilia is so affected by things. Man. Why does race matter so much to people, man? <laughs> Damn fuck. Slothful Puck. <laughs> puck isn't too bad when he's not a mass murdering monster. <laughs> Well, this is this is a very, very calm little special here. There's barely any music. It's just Amelia and the and the silence around her. I can really feel the loneliness. Just sitting here, like taking it in. I really feel the kind of loneliness she's like experiencing. Hell yeah. <laughs> That's terrifying. Yeah, I don't think that's how Amelia works. She's more of like, I need to act than I need to run. She thinks about everyone before herself. Apparently, as you can see here, hides herself away for the sake of others. Uh, I think they're there to catch her. Oh. Not poggers, dude. 
<clears throat> Why did you have to go here, Amelia? Just still trying to help these guys out, Amelia. All right. Damn. Oh, there it is again. There's just different this time, or something else completely. What is happening? What is this? Obviously, it's something to do with Amelia. Right? Oh. Oh! Oh, what the fuck? Uh-huh. <laughs> oh god, what is gonna be happening to the people? Oh, you just told her- told him that she was in there? Oh, okay. You're thinking too much about everyone else except yourself. Oh. Oh my god. I mean, you can be creepy whenever you want. Jesus Christ. What is this now? Okay. Poof, gone. <laughs> what the fuck is happening? But are they... They're not real, are they? She made them? Or are they people like her? Who are like, frozen in time or something? I feel like it's probably something more than what we think. What I think. You guys probably know. What is this now? Who is this? Kimi no Nanawa? Damn it! All the mysteries! Go <laughs> sniffy sniffy again. Well, hey, at least you got dead people to talk to, right? Oh, where are you going? Hello. Hello. <laughs> if I'm gonna guess, like, it's someone parental to Amelia. It sounded like it was like a very sad mother. Like, I'm sorry I left you. Oh, what now? Another one of these monsters? Oh my god, dude. What the fuck is that? My beast. It's so quiet most of the time. Okay. 
You lie much. Oh, cool. I didn't know you could skate or snowboard. Huh. Lesser spirit. Setting fire to the forest. What? Puck is not having this. Oh my god, that is big and fucking terrifying. It's the smooths. What power do you have inside of you that comes out when you're in danger? Oh my god, that's a lot of spirits. Weird. <laughs> maybe, or maybe not. Oh, uh, perhaps not. <laughs> bye bye. Oh, God, they're gone. Is that the Red Lesser spirit? Uh Yeah, it looks like it. Oh, it's just an eye watching her, wasn't it? Oh, wait, that's right. You were attacked. Okay. Not so cool. So apparently her anger makes her very strong. Okay. Racist. <laughs> Did you not know that? Because he's racist. Hitler, hello. <laughs> yeah, this is fucking fucked up. Okay. I hate shit like this so much. This is exactly why I love ReZero. Like, it pulls shit like this. <gasps> Finally, you call for help! Like, this is- this is fucking insane. Yes.
Ain't gonna be laughing for long, buddy. Puck is not like anything else in this world, it seems. Well, here we go again. Ooh. <laughs> well, bye bye. That was easy. Damn. Free Zero doesn't hold back with her messages, dude. Doesn't matter. Why do you speak in riddles? You are sin. Affirmation. Okay, dude. Pocket, this is your time to smack, okay? This is your time to fucking smack. You know what? I got a theory in my mind right now. That Puck may be a parent of Familia, that's deceased. That's why he calls her daughter the whole time, maybe? Puck may- I mean... Details. This guy needs to fucking go, dude. I'm curious who made Puck, like, who talked to Puck about protecting her. <laughs> well, this now makes sense why Puck would go fucking nuts seeing Amelia dead. And turn into a big rage monster. Beep. That almost got me. Oh boy. Does not hold back, does it? Oh, here's the big monster! Ooh! The beast of the end. Saying the same thing over again, dude. I get it. She's a witch. She's a half demon. Anything else? So that's why she was worried. There were actually people in the forest. Oh, I'm referring back to when she was in the mansion. Okay. <laughs> oh. Good for you. Just Amelia. The witch who lives in this forest. <laughs> Wow. 
That's so beautiful. Oh my fucking god. Puck looks terrifying like that. <laughs> I'd just like to say. What? Getting some puck backstory here, and I love it. Who the fuck was Puck? I want to know that. I guess it doesn't matter, but I still want to know. Just the fact that it was a person or something. A long time ago. Oh. That's why you call her a daughter, huh? <laughs> okay, so he, it's a self-proclaimed title then, kind of, and also like that, yeah. I would have liked it to actually have been her father, like reincarnated or something. I feel like that would have made more impact. Leah. <laughs> I'm almost bursting at the seams here, guys. I've been so close to crying this whole time. Oh, there it is. A little bit. It's so pretty! Free zero, you don't hold back. You, you, you kill me. Oh my god. Oh. So sweet. So sweet. So fucking sweet. Isn't it? It's bittersweet. It got me at the end. <laughs> Damn, dude. That was really good. A nice backstory. Needed backstory for Amelia. We haven't got much of her. And finally, we see some spotlight for Amelia. We needed that. I, I needed that to see, like, what she was, what she was, who she was, and, like, what significance she gave in place. And now that I know that she, her relationship with Subaru makes so much more, it, it feels so much warmer. Feels so much warmer. Oh, okay, I'm gonna let this play and I'm gonna be around if there's an after credit. So uh, I'll see you around then. I'll I'll enjoy this song until then. Is there gonna be something? Hey, 
Hey, the future! We're in the future, thank god! Let me see Subaru. Come on, let me see him being nice to her. She deserves it. Yes! yes. Hey! Oh, doesn't it feel great? <gasps> it looks like the ones in the forest! Oh, yeah, I would imagine, wouldn't she? Oh. Oh, <laughs> Rosewall, you're you man of a man. Alright, bye bye. So are those elves forever stuck in the forest, or can they at some point? No, that's fine. She appreciates the gesture. Nothing lasts forever. But does that mean that at some point they will be freed, if they're still there? They can be freed! But will they? Is she going to be able to pursue that? <laughs> That's right. That's my boy. So it's it, you can't undo it, it, it. You have to wait for it to do itself. Is that what I'm getting from this? Man, what a wonderful story this is, isn't it? Oh, Three Zero is such a good fucking show. They're just hitting all the right buttons for me. <laughs> Honestly, it's so good. Okay, I hope you enjoy that. <laughs> I'll see you for season two starts tomorrow. Yes. We're doing season two tomorrow. I hope you're excited for it. I am fucking beyond thrilled to be able to see it now. And I, I can't wait. Um, there is no director's cut for season two. There is a regular. Uh, apparently there's a season two part one and part two. So we're going to be doing 13 episodes per part. But it will still be uh, 26 episodes I think. So yeah. I will just do that there's not going to be like season one part two episode one reaction there's just going to be one two three four and then up to 26 i think i think that's how i'm going to do it if you guys have a different opinion let me know uh let me know what you think and if there's something i missed in this in this reaction please let me know uh explain i love seeing you guys explanation and and teaching me stuff about the show that i didn't already know i really appreciate it i love seeing you guys being so engaged in the comments uh it really makes me happy <laughs> honestly it does uh just be careful about spoilers I don't like spoilers. I have I have a guy who's seen ReZero who who uh, ma manages my channel. So just in case. Uh, but yes, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you tomorrow for season two. Bye bye.